Well, Providence Police top brass are taking a hard look at some recent incidents involving officers and the public. Today, we're hearing about the kind of scrutiny some officers are facing for how they handled things. 12 News reporter Kayla Fish joins us live now with the strong words from the city's public safety commissioner. Well, two Providence public uh, police officers, rather, were taken off the street pending review of their use of force when arresting three teens earlier this month. There is body camera video of the incident, and while that has not yet been made public, Providence Public Safety Commissioner Stephen Perry called what he saw in the video excessive. The incident happened July 9th. Three teens were accused of driving recklessly through the city, refusing to stop for police, and running red lights. Two of the officers who responded to arrest the teens were officers Domingo Diaz and Mitchell Voyer. They have since been suspended with pay, pending a criminal investigation into their alleged use of force, involving the AG's office, state police, and Providence Police investigating. Commissioner Perry has not said specifically what the officers are accused of doing, though he said they did not discharge any weapons, but one of the teens was hospitalized. Look, I'm not going to describe the force, but uh, I saw excessive use of force uh, in some of the body cams that is both troubling and appalling. And Perry says they hope to expedite this review, but they want it to be as thorough as possible. He added that the release of the body camera footage is pending the criminal investigation. Live in studio, I'm Kayla Fish, 12 News.